Hi everyone and welcome back to the voiceover. So for this look, oh my god, I had the worst time, even worse than when I had to do the last die mission, uh, the devil look with the red body paint. This one was a pain in the ass. So uh, later on you'll see that the base kind of looks just like chunky and ugly and I don't know if that was because like I just let it sit on my face for too long. Like I like to let concealer warm up on my face but I feel like body paint is a whole nother beast and so I feel like I kind of fucked up a little bit on this bin but you know we all can't have uh you know freaking Snazaru and Mayron paints those are so fucking expensive. Uh, but yeah, so you gotta do with what you got, you know, and sometimes your base ends up looking ugly. On the camera, it doesn't look too, too bad, but I took some pictures and I was just looking at it in the mirror and it looks really bad and really ugly. So, uh, if you have any blue or white body paints, honestly, just mix them on your hand before you put them on your face and then just work as fast as you can because the more you put on, the more it takes away from the initial layer. But yeah, um, for the eyes and the eyebrows. The eyebrows, I just uh, extended my eyebrows a little bit front to kind of make me look a little sad. Because that's how her eyebrows are. I didn't really want to dry on eyebrows. Because I'm not good at it. Um, for the eyeshadow, I really wanted my eyes to look really, really round and less like elongated like I would usually do with eyeliner. So right above my crease, I'm going in with a, with a really like um, bright blue shadow. And then underneath my lash line... Like right underneath where I you would usually put eyeshadow, I'm going to um, put some navy blue eyeshadow. And then on my lid, I'm going to go in with that navy blue eyeshadow. And then um, I'm going to take another uh, kind of shade in the same family from the Urban Decay Vice palette that's a little bit darker than the navy one. And I'm going to pack that on my lid as well. Just to kind of make, make my eyes look more round and less... Uh, less? I mean, I want to look more cartoonish, you know? I don't want to look like my face. I want to look like her face I, don't, I think her name is emily in the movie i don't know uh yeah i don't know if it's all title, but yeah we're doing curves by makeup but yeah she has a very she has humongous big old eyes her face is pretty simple i know she has there's like a bone sticking out uh in her right cheek but from all the reference photos i couldn't really find that and i also decided it was too complicated so i'm not gonna do it uh but yeah i'm gonna blend out this base a little bit but oh my god it took me forever to blend out afterwards so we're gonna skip all of my nonsense and we're gonna go straight into putting the funnel touches on the base uh i added some fake i mean i have i have fake lashes i just don't know where they are so i just drew on some lashes with the eyeliner it actually looks really cute i actually really like it but yeah you can see my base is ugly and chunky and i hate it and then we're just gonna go in with the wet and water black paint on again and we're just gonna carve out the face make me look a little bit skinnier than i uh, usually would be and then i think um you can leave your lips alone if you want but uh she kind of has like a pink or a nude lipstick in the movie so later on um i just go in with that and i put a little bit of highlight on my nose and that's all that i got hope you guys enjoyed this one see you in the next one